to announce today the inaugural Mary Alice Hadley Prize for Visual Art, a $5,000 award for local visual artists to participate in enrichment experiences that will help them pursue their personal ambition and achieve their artistic potential. We are so pleased to partner with the Louisville Visual Art Association to present this prize. Our business is philanthropy, and their business is visual arts, so it's a perfect partnership. LVAA will manage the application and selection process for the Community Foundation. I am pleased to introduce Shannon Westerman, Executive Director of the LVAA, and Hadley Pottery owners, well, one of the owners here today is Fred Malin Smith. Thank you very much for being here. The prize is made possible through the George and Mary, Mary Alice Hadley Fund at the Community Foundation. Established in 1991, it supports the arts and humanities about Mary Alice Hadley, and I know we'll, we'll hear a little bit more in just a few minutes. But she was born into a family of tile makers. You could say this business got started on a houseboat. The story is Mary Alice made a set of dishes for her boat, and her guests caused such a stir, a year later, she and her husband established Hadley Pottery. Hadley Pottery has been here in Louisville for 73 years, and many of Mary Alice's wall, mur wall murals and pieces are on display here at the factory. Everyone has a story about Hadley Pottery, and I'm no exception. I moved to Louisville four years ago, and shortly thereafter had the opportunity to meet some friends in Florida. I wanted to bring a gift from Louisville, something made here. I found my way to Hadley Pottery, and I mean that, I found my way to <laughs> Hadley Pottery. There was something about a pig statue across the street, right across from that pig statue, a beautiful tray, I purchased a beautiful tray and coffee cup service adorned with palm trees. Every time I go back to Florida to visit this family, it's there on their kitchen sideboard. Mary Alice Hadley passed away in 1965, and several years ago the business changed hands. I want to thank the new team for their commitment to Louisville and their interest in supporting this prize. Their artistic team has been working on a design for the Pottery Prize that will accompany the cash prize that will best remember Mary Alice. And I want to thank Shannon and the team at LVAA for their partnership. Finally, here at Hadley Pottery, you can't help but think the spirit of Mary Alice surrounds us. So thank you, Mary Alice, for turning out those dishes back in 1939. This, we hope this prize serves as a, serves as a rich reminder of the importance of Hadley Pottery to the Louisville community. 